Still kind of getting used to this camera, but it's got that flip up screen, so I like that. I like that. Do a little bit of a smoke session here. Uh, it's hot as balls out there today. I do want to go skate, but if I go skating, it's only going to last about 20 minutes or half an hour in this heat. I have some videos that I want to make today at home. And that's about it for today. What are you guys doing today? I feel like I don't got much to say these days. Just gotta be open. So. <coughs> All right, life update, what can I say? It's hot as hell out there. I've been working part time lately. I owe the government a few thousand dollars, so I'm trying to pay that down. Staying low, avoiding spending money, focusing on making money, and uh, blading's been there. I don't know why, but I haven't uploaded on the channel for a week. I got some weed plants that are ready to get chopped down. So I'm going to start that process today. Make an update video on that. And I'm also working on some new merch as well. I'm trying to find, talk to some distributors. It's always a painstaking process because you're dealing with people on the other side of the world. Um, what else? What else? I have a wedding next year in Mexico, but I'm debating whether or not I'm going to go or not because here in Canada we got travel restrictions and I don't want to necessarily have to take a COVID test and quarantine or fight the quarantine and take a charge. All for a free wedding. I'm second guessing it right now. Second guessing that. Um, but yeah, anyways, I don't know. I don't know really what I'm saying. I'm smoking, having a good morning right now. My brother just moved out into a new condo. So I guess I can give you a little a little vlog about that going to my brother's place. I've been finding it hard to vlog lately. I don't know what it is. <clears throat> I have a whole list of different episodes that I want to accomplish as well, and I haven't been able to do it in the past 2 months. But I guess I got to be stop. I guess I got to stop being so hard on myself. Because there's no rush to get about. After a breakup, kind of like some people bounce back into it right away. Some people take their time. I'm taking my time. I've been working out quite a bit, so it's good to keep on moving. 
You can see in my face how clammy it is out here right now. Shiny. Dreadlocks. The dreadlock lifestyle has been amazing. A little bit heavy these days because they are getting like almost seven years. But they are growing mighty fast. And when I have them like all to one side like this, like it's a big mass. It's a lot of hair to carry around on a day to day basis. And I ask myself, why do I carry around so much hair? I don't have to carry around this much. I could trim them down to a more comfortable length, but every time I get passionate about something, I always like hold on for as long as I can. And uh, for these, I don't know, I just feel like the length on freeform locks really holds like power almost. Like it holds respect, it holds stories, it holds experience. That's why I really want to make it to 10 years before I decide to trim them. But I've already decided that there will be some trimming taking place eventually. I'll just do my best to do it at the 10 year mark and not before. The beard's been doing pretty good. My dad wants me to shave it down. My brother's beard is even bigger than this. But I like having the beard. It's comfy. It's a lot more comfortable than shaving, that's for sure. That is for sure. I realize I'm a collector. I like collecting things. One thing I collect is cameras. <laughs> and there's no way around it I've realized. Like, Cameras are just so fascinating, so fascinating to me. I've always, I'm always going to be collecting them. You know, and I picked up th this camera yesterday. It's a Sony A5000. And I have some lenses for it already, so I figured, yeah, I'll, I'll grab that camera because uh, it's a good deal. And I can definitely use it for vlogging because the the <clears throat> the screen flips up at the back, like. Yeah, this is the A5000. Cool little camera. I have been uh, practicing filming more things vertical. And it's funny because I used to hate filming things vertical. Vertical. But now I actually love it. And I actually feel like it's going to be the future of my filmmaking. Is vertical videos. Uh, <coughs> ooh, hear that? The sound of the cicadas are out. Amazing. That's how you can tell it's a hot, humid day, when you can hear cicadas. They're such cool insects. They're like flapping their wings.
focus on the spliff close up there. Oh, pretty close. Let's see here. See how the mustache starts to touch the lip there? I can't do it. I gotta keep that trimmed. Guys like Damian Marley, I give much respect because his grow like all the way into his mouth almost and <clears throat> I don't know how people can I don't know how people can keep up with that. For some reason filming with a screen that reverses back to you for the selfie image really helps. It really, really helps and a lot of my cameras over the years haven't had that reverse screen. I'm not a fan of taking selfies. But if I gotta do it for YouTube or video wise like this with the screen, then I'll do it, you know. For that close up smoke session. And I keep looking at the screen up top there, I, I'm mesmerized. I'm just having fun with the camera. And I guess I'm trying to just not feel the pressure of having to do a daily vlog or something like that. <clears throat> I'm thinking about it too much maybe. Or not enough. But essentially I just gotta remember that Playing around with cameras is the best part. That's this is why I'm into it. Is this messing around with the lens and the gear and the tech, understanding the craft, and then I just I have I'm lucky to have a place to upload it and share it for you guys here. And if any if any of you guys are interested in learning uh, filmmaking techniques. Or, or or landscape photography or cameras in general or YouTubing uh, I will be doing a online class as well so uh, let me know in the comments below if you're interested in joining the class it's gonna be an hour long over zoom and uh, yeah we'll get a pop in I want to really show you guys the skill sets that I got in all aspects of life and if you're interested in learning them then come on by you know and yeah the weeds good traveling isn't so much right now I've been staying I've been locally exploring I've been noticing a lot more aircrafts in the air airlines are ramping up again Airlines are really ramping up. They have been slow for a very long time. And what else? Uh, That was fun. Been messing around with with uh, music lately, but old school mediums like tape cassettes, vinyl records, forty fives. I'm really trying to preserve this technology as much as I can. Tape cassettes and. Uh, vinyl players, VCRs, recorder, audio recorders. I love the nostalgia to it and the fact that it still works. And that's the shit that got me into it these days, right? Like, check this out right now. I'll show you this right here. 
This is this is something I've been messing around with. I found this in the garbage the other day. It's a Panas uh, it's a Panasonic five disc CD changer, but these are all busted. Like I can't eject worth shit. It just gives me an error. Um, the tape the tape decks will like work, but they don't really sound the best, so they don't really work either. Uh, so essentially. It came with these two speakers here, but uh, essentially it's hooked up to this uh, through aux through an aux cable right here is hooked up, and this is a tape recorder. This one is called Struns and Farha Americas. It's some Latin music. Play. And then on here I go to auxiliary. It should be working. Rewind, fast forward, play, stop, eject, sick, right? So it's like, when else, when else are you going to see uh, and use cassettes? Again, found these in the garbage, a whole bunch of them. This tape recorder I've had for a while, but to find these cassettes, it's kind of magical. Yeah, well, that's about it. 20 minute recording almost here. I'm seeing how long this camera can actually go. But uh, I'm gonna end this video here. I'm gonna let it. I'm gonna let it keep on recording. Let's see what the timer gets to. So if you haven't already, hit that like button. Thanks for watching all the way. Subscribe if you haven't, and I will see you guys in the next video. Peace. What's up, Zig? What's up? Give me a shine!